Hey guys, it's Emily back to the video, and today I'm going to talk about my city name is not, um, in New York. Again, it's New York. Um, so today is all I'm going to tell you about, um, I'm trying to tell about me and my best friend, Henry. My boy space friend. No dating here. Yeah, so yeah, me and my friend Henry were bullied. So this story takes place, so this story takes place in California. Yes, California. Place for my embarrassing story that I told you guys last time. If you guys didn't catch the video, uh, go check it out. Um, yeah, that's the thing. Uh, yeah, this place, yeah, this story takes place, sorry. This story takes place back in California during 6th grade. And this is like, and this is like way before COVID. So like before the, all the masks and craziness. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, before the masks and craziness, basically. Uh, me and Henry are working on this, um, this thing like a history project we were working on together. And this boy in my class called Reed, um, he went up to some of my other friends and, like, they weren't good friends with, like, me and Henry, they were just, they were just friends that I happened to be in a group chat with. And they came up and they're like, are you guys dating? And we're like, I was like, no. I had three times, and, like, and Henry was just like, so, and... It really upset me and Henry, so like, Henry started crying, and the, and like went out back, where like, I mean like, our core classroom had like, 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 the like, entrance, like, like, to like, the back of our classroom, so Henry out there, because Henry was crying out there, and like, I followed him, because I didn't want to be crying in class, because that's actually, that's actually really humiliating, <laughs> like, to me now, that's, like, I don't think I was, but if I could start crying, that's not, like, that's really humiliating, that's like, really embarrassing, so I, so I kind of remember I like Ryan and Reed, yes, the boy, who, he's like, you guys need to come back in, and like, fine. I guess sorry and, like, started working, and, like, they just, like, kept asking us, and, like, we just, like, I'm like, I'm like, oh, my God, guys, just stop. So then, and, like, that went on for, like, another few weeks. Like, everywhere we're going, you're like, are you guys saying, like, just, like, oh, my God. And I just kind of like, just took no notice of it, and then, like, this one time I was um going I was going I was having a play with Henry and these um and these two two of the girls in my who I happened to be in the house with, they asked me if I wanted to go on this date with this boy called Ryan. And it's like we were in sixth grade time, huh? like no like and like me and Ryan didn't really know each other. We like we really only just went like to the same elementary school having to be like in the same like class together so like no. And I left. And I was telling Henry, like, what is wrong with these people? And I had a fun day at Henry's house. And obviously, and, like, I went back home. Because obviously I wasn't sleeping when you were there. Because, like, I think it was, oh, God. It was a Wednesday that happened? I don't know. But I came back home. And then, like, and then I saw um, a message from, someone, from one of the girls in the group chat saying, hey, so that's, so that's, so that's yesterday with Ryan. I'm like, like, oh my god, like, and like, in my head, like, oh my god, but, and I just, I just wrote, just, I just wrote, no, and it was just, thank you, and it was just, um, and it was just, um, so I was like, no, and, and like, for the next few weeks, um, no one, um, asked us if we were dating, and so me and Henry, uh, we fortunately, yeah, I don't know why I thought this, but we thought the, like, joke, though, although I'm pretty sure it's starting to be a rumor if we were not telling people, but yeah, we thought it was over, and then, like, in the next few weeks, our teacher, um, had to leave, and she hadn't been able to find a sub, so, um, we went over to this teacher's class, who was, like, like, right over the hall, and then Reed's like, are you guys dating, like, in a whisper voice, and I'm like, oh my God, and like we were going over to play at Henry's house like again that day, so we just like we ignored him, and then we're like, and, and, Henry, said, and Henry says we're not freaking dating, and like these people have a problem, and like we just left it, and it was just like really upsetting, and like I didn't really tell anyone, so um I didn't even tell Abby. Who is right here? And let me tell you the joke of the day. What is a penguin's favorite ice cream? I know this one. 
you ask? Wait, you ask? Fantastio. I can't read that. Hang on, let me see. <laughs> I'm sorry, I suck at reading. Oh, pistachio. <laughs> pistachio, you guys have pistachio in there. Pistachio, pistachio, that's what I guess. Right. So yeah, that's the sort of time me and you really. And to end it, I'm gonna tell you my joke. Why are penguin shops so busy? The answer is because of the fish fillet. Fish fillet. So what's 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 the result of that, the fish fillet? It's like, oh no way, I get it. Fish fillet is a real thing. I think we love fish. Yeah. Fish and fillet. this is... And they are from a brand called Penguin Biscuits. Apparently they're only available in England. Sorry, guys. Are you sure they're though? Of course, they're unique. It's unique. You're mm -hmm. unique. You're unique, sorry. And they're actually... The inside is that. Sorry for my finger, guys. I really don't do this often. It's probably the last time you're ever gonna see it. Ah, yeah, pretty good. But anyway, that was the story of the time me and Henry Bully. So, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to subscribe to join the Nature Protectors. And also the gods! Yeah, sure. Bye, guys.